Um, played Wings a little bit. Definitely has some really good combos. We'll see if he's able to bring that out uh, against the Falcon. Um, I think the main thing is, I think that'll be pretty solid is Falco's pretty good at uh, using Fair to gimp off stage, mm -hmm. especially against a character like Falcon. He uh, uh, hits the Rock Croc. Um, he's able to actually use the, just tech the wall and then Fair immediately after, which will, in general, kill Falcon. Uh, depending on percent. Yeah, exactly, and and you got to watch out for that laser off stage as well. You know, taking Falcon's jumps. Um, Captain Falcon has a, a fairly decent recovery, but um, you know, once they're without that jump, it can be kind of predictable. Um, you know, similar to to Falco in a way as well. So um, right now, Wings with the dominant lead. Yeah, great start here from Wings. Just gets that combo that I was talking about. Um, and Katum though does have him off stage and get something started here. Uh, good Nair isn't able to convert off of it at that percent though. It was good DI from Wings, um, but Wings just kind of trapped at the ledge right now. Yeah, I, I really like. Um, well, well. Right before <laughs> I say anything, uh, Katum gets back air to uh, right to the back of the head. But um, I like how Katum sort of spaces out um, in in preparation for Wings to um, get the side B, and, and then he uh, he's punished it twice now out of out of four times. Um, and that was a really nice down smash tech chase read uh, as well, or tech read as well. Um, the wings right now, of course, uh, juggling with, with Falco. That's um, definitely the best aspect of the character. And that landing hitbox from the fair going to poke. Um, Kadem dropping shield, catch him dropping shield a little bit. I can catch players off guard if they're not familiar with the, uh, the matchup. So um, Kadem trying to swing right now, trying to close up the stock. Wings, though, building up a nice chunk of extra credit here. Yeah, I like what uh, Wings is doing here. He just keeps using Ooh. laser. What a down here coming out from Wings. Uh, just catches the top of that up the recovery and uh, able to spike Kaden down, taking the stock lead up by two. Um, but what I was saying was uh, he's doing a really good job at, as you're saying, getting that extra credit, uh, especially with laser. When he's off stage every time, get Kaden with about like one or two lasers just to rack up some extra percent and allow him to recover back to stage. Oh, he's looking for it. <laughs> oh, I thought he was going to go for the dare. Yeah, I, I really like um, you know the the laser usage. Good nair there coming out from Kadem. Um, uh, I think the biggest thing here is like um, you know obviously Wings is, is is doing these these combos pretty well, but um, a lot of this uh, these positions that Kadem gets himself stuck in this, these disadvantageous positions are just from him like dropping shield on um, you know a fair or something. So um, just you know having a little bit more patience, um, being able to hold that shield just like a tad bit longer, I, I think will. Um, you know, it, 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 it makes a mile out of an inch, you know what I'm saying? So, um, yeah, like right there, that was good patience and, and he's leading it into a really, really strong combo here. Doesn't get the knee to finish, but gets some substantial damage and now Wing's stuck on the edge. Yeah, I really like what Kadem has, uh, kind of adapted to this near the, uh, end of the game. Uh, really has got these combos started, used, uh, Falcon's good burst options well to get in on Wings and not allow him to get that. Uh, up tilt that Falco's love to get just it just combos into literally everything it wants. Yeah, exactly. Wings now gonna go ahead and roll on the ledge. Kadem at his last stock. Wings two stocks here at kill percent. Both players at kill percent rather, but um, I mean uh, I've I've seen comebacks from crazier percentages here. Wings gonna go ahead and up B and, and Kadem missing the dare there. Um, it's a pretty tight timing to get, but the turnaround up B will take it. Good command grab option through the shield, able to kill. And now um, both uh, players even stocks, and now they are not. <laughs> yeah, uh, looks like Kadem tried to air dodge back to stage. That caused him to actually uh, die that last stock. Um, really uh, turned it around, though. I would say uh, near the second half of the game. Oh, Captain Falcon turned around. Did you say? <laughs> <laughs> I did. He did turn around, my but boy. in the good way. <laughs> oh, oh. My boy, Star Falcon. Where are you at? Uh, yeah, no, definitely. I, I think. Um, Kadem was was definitely starting to, to bring it back there. Um, you know, it's it's all about the adaption. You know, especially in these um, you know these best of three sets. Um, you know, you, you take what you can. You, you use game one. You know, on that neutral stage to learn. Um, you know, especially in a matchup that maybe you're a little unfamiliar with. Um, sometimes you need a little bit of time to sort of get get your bearings in that matchup. And um, you know, I think we saw near the end of that, Kadem was definitely starting to figure it out. So. Uh, we'll see if he can bring that knowledge into game two and um, have maybe a bit of a stronger start um, leading into this uh, second game of the set. Yeah, um, I think their adaptations are really good. Um, so we'll see 
how Wings adjust that as well, because um, you know both players will have to make different adaptations to uh, their play style. Caden did a really good job at just using Falcon's first option to get back into the game, um, and we're starting to actually hit those combos. Almost got that uh, near one up here to knee, uh, just narrowly missed it. Um, we'll, we'll see what Caden decides to counterpick to. Facts. Yeah. Oh, Dith in the Dith in the comments in the chat. I, I definitely agree with that. Um, Kaden was getting some good mileage out of that um, Falcon there. Um, Wings was getting hit a lot of times by the second hit too, just getting sent off stage by that. Um, so see if uh, that comes into play anymore. Yeah, I'm interested to see what stage they're going to. Um, I would kind of think Triplex, but at the same time, that's so good for Falcon. I'm um, actually we go to Kalos. Um, I like this. I, I kind of like this uh, pick from Tatum. Actually, uh, gives him some extra recover, recovery mix-ups with the uh, wall jump, as well as just that extra side platform can be really nice for Falcon for extending their combos. I totally agree. Yeah, I think it can be kind of tough to land against Falco here, um, just because you don't really have platforms in the center of the stage to go to. But um, you know, having those side platforms opens up a little bit of uh, opportunity. And um, especially in, in Falcon's advantage state, I think this can be a strong pick. So um, we'll see if it pays off for him. Right now, it's fairly even. Uh, Wings off stage now. Get him going to try and figure out a ledge trap. Wings able to just side B uh, right through the drop shield. Yeah, it was a good mix up from Wings. Uh, baiting maybe a fair. Um, so Caden tried to end up dropping shield there, able to get back to stage. But um, it's a scary spot here for Wings. Does use that wall jump well, though. Doesn't have to force his up B, um, which is pretty easy for Falcon Spike. But here, oh, tries to go for the back air actually. Um, I'm kind of surprised we didn't hear to see just like a short hop down air, but um, can be kind of tough to time it and um, can be a little scary to just put yourself in that situation. So you need a lot of confidence to challenge an be like that. Yeah, exactly. And I think his positioning was just a little bit off there, but does get that F smash to take the first stock. Um, whip punishes uh, wings there. Yeah, that was really good, um, sort of a fade away, you know, alter your positioning, right? Um, of course, recognizing your opponent wants to land on you with an aerial, so you just sort of back it up, let them land in that empty space with their aerial, and then punish their landing. But um, Wings going to go ahead and answer right back and uh, even up the game here. Yeah, one thing I, I have noticed from Wings, every time he's gotten down throw, he's had really good DI um, in order to escape uh, Falcon's combos. Um, yeah. Each time, Kaden really has only got one nair off it, or maybe two up airs, um, depending on the percent. But Wings isn't allowing him to really get those kill confirms off it if he were to like DI in by chance. Yeah, I totally agree. Um, I think that's where Wings has been shining in this uh, in this set. Oh, looking for that spike, <laughs> the uh, uppy. Just gonna go ahead and. Um, Skip the ledge and just go straight on the stage. Um, good choice by Wings there. Gonna look for the up throw back air, gets it. And uh, Kadem now off stage. Try not to get spiked here. Ooh, can't tech that, but actually not so strong that it kills Wings. So Wings, another lease on life here. I like that up tilt there, catching out that spot dodge um, or the drop shield. Maybe uh, Wings expecting something a little bit faster, maybe a dash tack or a side beat. Um, but Kadem gets that. And uh, I didn't really recognize this at first, but. The Kalos stage pick also allows Kaden to live longer from those up throw up air combos that uh, Falco does have and wants that higher percents because once they're out of that percent range, it's a lot harder for Falco to get that kill confirm, just needs a raw bear. Yeah, definitely. Oh, and that up B will tack on a little bit of extra percent now. Uh, forward throw definitely will not kill here. Oh, and actually the mash out um, doesn't even matter. So uh, Wings now looking to close this stock out, but Kaden oh. with a really good up air string here. Oh, but the aggressive ledge um, option to come back with that back air, really smart. Wall jumping off the side of the stage to reposition yourself to hit that back air. Uh, Wings showing his knowledge of the the, uh, the stage. I love that weight there from Wings. Uh, got that combo and put Kadem in a tech situation. Uh, just narrowly missed it with that grab that would have um, confirmed into another up air. Um, but still has him in disadvantage. Kadem able to take it back though. Yeah, both players also um, going for maybe a little bit too uh, too many pummels. Um, I, I think we've seen both players mash out of grabs now, um, just after they've been pummeling. Uh, Kaden with no jump here, able to just get back for free. Wings opting not to edge guard and would rather just set up the ledge trap, and it pays off. Gets the dash back forward smash to take the set. Yeah, good stuff there from Wings. Um, takes the set 2-0. Really close games, though. Um, I think Kaden made some good uh, adaptations to their play. 
and uh, made that game two a lot closer than game one was. Yeah, I totally agree. Um, so wings with the dub, Kanem going to go down to losers bracket, um, see what they can do down there. Um, we'll be moving on to our next game, with his, which is Dith versus Toastfish. Um, I'll just